Hello world, my name is Tim Roswick, and today I'm going to teach you how to add your game to the Twitch and Mixer databases. Now you're asking, why would I want to add it to a database? Well, if streamers are playing your game, or if people are looking for your game, what they're actually probably going to do is hit browse, and they're going to look for games, right? That's how people find stuff on Twitch. And you want your game to show up here for two reasons. One, so if someone's actually looking for a stream of your game, it shows up in search and it shows up with the actual box art. And then two, if streamers are going to play your game, they need to be able to list it, Fortnite for example, as the game that they're currently playing. Otherwise, it just kind of looks unprofessional and uh, you could lose fan viewership that way, right? So, how you add one to Twitch is pretty easy. You go over to a website called giantbomb.com, which has a database of a bunch of different games. And the first thing you want to do is you want to create an account here. Uh, you don't need to pay anything. You just hit the basic free version. Just go ahead and uh, create an account. And then once you're logged in, you want to go up here to wiki and then go down to games. And I'll give you a link directly to this this list so you you don't have to actually follow this you could just click the link once you're logged in but if you scroll down here it'll say create new game page that's what you want to click so you can click this or you can click the link and then on the description and just go straight there create new game page and then it's going to ask you for the name the image and you want to upload the actual box art you want to upload your official short description and then why should you add this uh because you made it and it's beautiful and it's a work of art that's it that's all you got to do it takes a day or two for uh for them to approve it because your wiki score is low when you create a new account so like you can't just automatically create games uh but they i had no problem approving Phallophobia. it was it was it was pretty easy uh and then mixer to add to mixer mixer uses a different database called player.me uh so you want to go ahead and create an account here and this process is pretty similar uh you just go over to discover then you go to games once you're logged in and then there's a little plus button down here and you just hit plus and you suggest a game and you're going to want to add your game title, uh, your extra info, ESRB rating. You probably don't have one. I don't. Uh, description about the game and then you the cover and the game and, and the links and all that. Uh, that's it. That's all you do. It's it's really really simple. It's extremely confusing because most people don't know that they got to go do this stuff, but it's it's very 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 beneficial. Um, to do uh and if you don't know my game which i've added to both of these databases philophobia the fear of love launches on february 10th so uh wish list it down below uh make sure you add that and, and and buy it and leave a review and all that good stuff if this video helped you out but my name is tim russwick and thank you for watching i hope that was helpful i'll see you in the next video